I have been talking so much about relationships with, within the date. And I want to take a break about these segments because, I don't know, I just feel that I want to talk about something from my heart. Something just uh, that comes to my mind. And that something is about happiness. What is happiness? Now we could define happiness as a state of joy, contentment, good fortune, etc. And many people said, I am so happy because I won the lottery. I'm so happy because I uh, have a great job. I have a great family. Is that a fortune? Is that a state of mind? What is it that makes you happy? Sometimes people say that they are so unhappy because they can find the things that they are dreaming for or are desiring for. No having what we want cannot make us so miserable. Because that's why life evolves every time. And if we have something that doesn't make us happy, there are so many ways that we go, go and find something that really, <clears throat> really make us happy. Small things. You know, sometimes like this box, I was just looking at it and it brings a lot of happiness. Just something so small because there is something so meaningful. Happiness is about small things. Happiness is about something that can bring us to encounter with ourselves, but most importantly for people who believe in God, happiness is having a good relationship with God. There is nothing else that can, ha can help us to experience that joy that building a good relationship with God. We cannot allow society to condition our happiness. But sometimes society pretends to condition who we are, what we are, and how we should be. And I have seen this many times, even with our families. Sometimes our families want to tell us what to do with our lives. They want to design our dreams. They want to design our goals. And yes, probably they have their best interests in their minds for us. But it doesn't mean that they can trace our way of happiness. Happiness is about having a relationship with yourself. Knowing who you are. And especially knowing and accepting what you are. So when we talk about happiness, I don't pretend just to tell you all the secrets for happiness because, you know, many people and are trying to define it and give you what you need to be happy. Many people and many books are there in libraries and the internet trying to say that's how you have to be happy. That's the secret to be happy. But I think that because we are so unique, we are so unique that one thing cannot apply to all of us. One book cannot apply to all of us, can give us something. What is it that makes you happy? Are you happy? So I, wanna, I want you to do an exercise today. And uh, when I was preaching many times, I said this to people, when I said, hello, how are you? And look into their eyes. So many people say, fine. And then they continue it. If someone say hi to you today, good morning, hola, como estas? Just even if you are struggling, even if you are in the age of, oh my God, what is it with my life? Say, I'm great. You are bringing, bringing a positive thought to your mind. I am wonderful. Today is going to be a great day. But you know, especially today is Monday. Many, and I have done this many times. Good morning, how are you? You know it's Monday. You know how Mondays are. You know it's just the beginning of the week. And we feel so miserable knowing that we have so many blessings. We have the opportunity 
to wake up today, to go to war. We have a war, we have a job. We have something that so many people don't. Those little things contribute and help us to be happy. So friends, thank you so much for watching. Stay healthy, be healthy, and help someone to be healthy today. See you next time.